There are probably many of you who are first time viewers who have no idea what this is all about, so let me explain. We're in a screenplay, Bart's Chai Stamps. 30 pages, too long to make a good festival run, too short to be a feature film. But there's always the web. And I have a YouTube channel with a fairly devoted following. I don't get Bieber numbers by any stretch of the imagination. We decided to release it to the web, put some ads on it, and see how far it goes. Here's the synopsis. A group of Indians in a small urban village in New Delhi never suspected that their foreign friend George had a dark history. And now, a mysterious assailant from George's past is threatening the lives of the village's inhabitants. These otherwise docile citizens who would just as soon wave the disturbance off with the chelte chelte end up forming into the perfect cocktail of resistance when George's attacker takes his collateral damage too far. For these everyday citizens, enough is enough, and at Barat's Chai Stand, these innocent bystanders will take their stand. This is Jamie Alter. He auditioned for the part of George. And got it. Jamie has really come on board with this project, and without his help, I really don't know if I'd have anything to report, honestly. His first contribution to the project was translation. And even in the auditions, Jamie was helping fine tune the Hindi Urdu because some of the English didn't work so well when translated directly. <laughs> I just love watching him because he just gets every expression and mannerism and pronunciation just like a native speaker would because he is in fact a native speaker, he's lived here all his life. But it's still weird to see a white guy who can speak with such fluency. One day, Jamie, I'm gonna catch up with you. One day. Sanjeev Mukherjee has gotten the part of Azam. Sanjeev is chief cricket correspondent for CNN IBN. He's really comfortable in front of the camera and he knows how to ham it up when necessary. So they're schooling me in some of the uh, impersonations I should do next. So what, we got Keshto, how does Keshto go? <laughs> Yeah! Yeah! Sir, Jimmy White! Yeah! Arnab Sen is playing Sanjeev's younger friend Prakash. Now, originally I had this part written much younger, like a teenager, but I decided to change it when I saw how Arnab and Sanjeev were interacting. I was really pleased with how they worked off of each other in our first promo, but more on that in a minute. Akash Sharma will be playing the role of Jay, local leader in the community who is holding a protest on the day that the big chase happens when the villain is wreaking havoc and Jay is there to help lend a hand and a lati. <laughs> Dude, he's just made for film. Look at this. Yeah, he is. So a couple weeks back, we flew by the seat of our pants and started shooting. What we shot is the first in a series of three promos that kind of serve as prequels to the film. It's almost kind of like watching a film that's based on a TV show. You know, you know the characters already, so you go into the film seeing what they're going to do narratively with these characters. And so this is our way to kind of give you an understanding of these characters and have some fun in the process, kind of trying to shoot with the same style, same kind of voice, and just give something to chew on as we are in the pre-production phase. The promo is called Prakash, George, and Azam, very creatively named. About Prakash. George and Azam. Azam being the owner of the saloon in which a lot of the action, even in the main film, takes place. Prakash is Azam's former employee and he just still hangs around Azam's shop all the time. And George, of course, is the foreigner who's just been hanging around this village for a few years and no one really knows where he came from or why he came, but he's learned the culture and learned the language perfectly. So he's just a staple of the community, although he does, as we already know, hide a dark past. The first part of this three-part prequel promo series <clears throat> is called The New Look. It focuses on Prakash's desire to impress a girl named Radhika by trying to make himself look like her favorite actor in preparation for a dance video he's going to release to YouTube to try to impress her. This one has been shot, edited, color corrected. It'll be uploaded next Wednesday, so please tune in to check that out. The Road Ahead requires us to find Bharat, a Radhika, and her friend Pinky. I will need to start a Kickstarter in the next few weeks or month. So if a short film about a mad chase scene through the streets of Delhi that takes an unexpected turn that can only happen in India sounds like an interesting premise to you, please spread the word. Don't forget that next week, the first episode of Prakash, George, and Azam premieres. Here's a few outtakes. <laughs> What are you doing? Ah! What did you do?